There's a moment in The Life We Chose by Matt Birkbeck when Russell Buffalino, head of the Northeast Pennsylvania crime family, turned to his driver and unofficially adopted son, Billy D'Elia, and asked him a poignant or possibly chilling question, depending on your point of view. W-N-E-W, America's original... He was just sitting back in his seat and had his eyes closed, like he always did. And after a while, he sits up and just blurts out, So are you going to be with me? He caught me off guard. I said I'd always be his son, and he'd always love my family, but he needed to know if I was going to be with him. I just looked at him and said, Sure, Russ, you always know I'd be with you. That was it. He stopped talking and put his head back. But the thing was... I didn't know what I said yes to, being with him. He couldn't have been talking about being made. My mother was Irish, so I didn't even think that was possible. And when Russell summoned Billy to meet him at the hotel the following Tuesday afternoon, Louis Del Vecchio guided Billy to a large conference room, where he was greeted by some of the most important mafia figures in the United States. There must have been 30, 40 guys there, but they were all made men. Russell puts his hand on my shoulder and says... You all know Billy is my son. Well, you're all here because he's one of us now. That was it. There was no sword or gun on a table or saints burning in your hand. None of that. So I couldn't be made, right? It didn't matter. Russell said it, and that was it. And then everyone in the room came up to congratulate me. I never really thought that could happen. And Billy was the last made member of the Buffalino family. Out on Tuesday, July 11th, The Life We Chose by Matt Birkbeck. Make sure you choose wisely.